Okay, guys, we are playing Dota Underlords. <clears throat> right now it's in a beta version. And uh, the game is pretty good. It's an auto chess type of game where you battle in rounds. You select your heroes before each round. And then once the round begins, the game... AI battles it out for you. Um, you play against other players as well. So um, it's pretty fun. The games are quicker than a normal round of Dota and you have a chance to you know create your own strategy. It's a little more casual than an ordinary uh, Dota. So you can play it on your mobile phone. Let's see. Some of my opponents actually see this symbol on the left. There's like a icon of a mobile phone beside these two guys and this guy as well. So yeah, three of my opponents are playing on their mobile. <clears throat> Okay, so our strategy for this game will be to be tanky. I really prefer a game with trolls and scales, the scaled alliance. But it's pretty random what kind of heroes are rolled out. So in the early stages, it's just okay to get whatever characters you want and then things get serious by round four so the first three rounds are neutral rounds I think this allows the people who are lagging or on bad connections to catch up with the rest of the players so it's an eight player um, battle royale, I would say, and these three rounds are for loot. It's for gaining loot, practically. So yeah, I am going for the scaled trolls. Since those aren't coming out just yet, um. Choosing heroes that would increase my chances of winning the opening round so that we can get a winning streak. So I've got a ranged hero over here, I've got a good tank, and also Bloodseeker, who's pretty strong. He goes in the back line. I think he targets the heroes with the least amount of HP. I'm not really sure how that works, but he just runs straight back. So that's always interesting. Um, I'm not liking this. So... Um... Nothing really interesting here. Maybe I can get... Bloodbound for now. As we go for our scaled units. Mm, let's try that. So no trolls and no scaled, but we do have one bloodbound alliance. Um not really liking our odds. Because Bloodseeker is very thin. You know, he's not like a tanky character. Um, so yeah, opening round was a loss, so we should go for a streak of losses so that we can gain some gold coins. Mm. Let's see how the rest of the first nine rounds pans out. And around 
round 10 things get a little serious so we'll see what the game gives us we've got finally we've got some trolls um, I'm not too keen on these guys anyways. So yeah. We've got five on three. I think we'll go for the winning streak. That's what I always want. I was thinking about Knights as a second option compared to trolls, but for now, these guys are gonna do the trick. I mean, Ogre Mage is pretty strong, tanky hero, and yeah, he gives us. Really good platform for <clears throat> the next few rounds. So we're trying to get a win streak going until about round 10, and then we can really see what kind of characters that we are rolling with. So far, um, yeah, we need more tankiness. That's what I'm getting to. I don't think we're gonna win this round. So we are going to go for more tankiness. Okay, finally got one more scale tier and another troll. Finally got Yeah, things are looking better now. So we got Troll. Um yeah. We've got Bloodbound Trolls. Let's see that use. Yep, I'm liking our odds, especially with a healer. Uh, Warlock is a pretty good healer. I think they buffed him up in this match. They gave him like a nice boost to heal him. So yeah, give me more scaled trolls. When I'm when I talk about scaled trolls, that's the alliances. So. This round. I do get the feeling that we need more tankiness, so we are going to say goodbye to our little friend and start getting some interest on these gold coins that I'm saving. So you get one gold coin for every 10 gold coins that you save each round. And that adds up all the way to 50 coins. So anything over 50 coins, it just stops earning interest. So you're better off spending anything above 50. So that's what we're trying to target for this particular match. Um, 50 coins so that we can get some nice interest going. Yeah, it's still early rounds, so teams are still starting to form out, hoping to get more scaled heroes into my lineup. And I think we have a good chance with that now, starting to form around here. Yep.
So it's six versus five. I think we got them. Let's, we got Ogre Mage, which is really, really thick ass tank. This we also have, you know, more armor. I think they all have the same starting armor. Yep, they do. Okay, so we're targeting more scaled trolls. I think we're doing okay. We we have a win streak now, so let's hope to continue that. I think we're doing okay with the alliances. Might need to get a little thicker on round eleven. So let's see how we do here. This is the first real test of uh, control rounds. So these guys are pretty tanky. They have lots of armor plus 20 armor, right? So I think we're gonna do okay. Most of our opponents have six, just a couple have five heroes. So I'm thinking of bringing in a tank give an extra 150 let's see what I can get going for the late game so uh, let's see how this round pans out this is gonna be our first test after the neutral round the next neutral round will be at round number 15, so it's every 5 rounds, I think. Yep, let's see what we've got. I'm still not sure how these matches are paired up every round. Must be some sort of round robin pattern. But I haven't really uh, read up on it yet. If you guys know how it works, let me know in the comments. I'm starting my new YouTube channel. And uh, this is going to be my first game that I review and play. So far, it's pretty good. It's pretty casual. You can play it on your phone. Um, it. It still is on beta version on Steam, so it's not the full actual game yet. It's called Underlords, but you won't see the Underlords in the game. They're just a bunch of pawns right now. No real heroes just yet, so we'll see how things pan out. But I'm pretty excited for what I've seen so far. The game is um, pretty fun. You know, it's your favorite Dota heroes. And it's more casual. Not as competitive. But I think later on they're going to have some tricks. I think this game will be pretty popular, especially since you can play it on the mobile phone gonna have a lot of chances to uh, uh, compete all around the world. Dota needs a desktop or a laptop and you really need to have a good team with you. This is more uh, individual strategy and I think later on they're gonna introduce a feature where you can play together with someone, so that's gonna be really fun. I'm excited for that. So our team just won that last round. Um, I think we're doing okay in the tankiness department. Let's check out this round. Okay, so he's got a tram protector and a bunch of ranged units. Yeah, I think... I think we have 
a good chance. But Sniper just really ruined those chances. <laughs> okay, so he did a good job by putting a trans protector. I think they buffed him up in this round so that he can really heal. Um, yeah, let's see what we come up with these. This this round kind of heroes were dealt with. Mm, not what I was wanted to get. I'm really going for trolled scaled trolls and um, so far doing okay I think. Let's make our slark a little tankier. Ooh, that was a good idea. But yeah, more health on. I mean, a force staff on Luna. Okay, round 15. We're not getting the scaled trolls. So we need to change our strategy a little bit and uh, go for yeah let's do this okay we finally got an upgrade yep so far I think this is gonna work You know, the first 15 rounds are a good test of what kind of team you can form up. It's, it's, it's really random. So sometimes you get a nice pick of characters. I mean, there's always your preferences, right? So for me, like I was saying, I prefer the Trolls and the Scaled Alliance. But you never know what you're gonna get, and maybe your opponents are also forming the same alliances. So far, no one is going for the scaled alliance, so I'm pretty, pretty happy about that. Hopefully, things start rolling in my direction. Yes, the massive madness. This is really a great item. Or slark. So I am going to give that to slark. So far, so good. I think we're doing a pretty good job here. Yeah, so far, so good. No balancing out your team. I like to win, but with this randomness, it, it really kills a lot of the strategy aspect. I mean, it throws a loop into your plans. It throws a, a wrench. So. I think the skill here is trying to balance out how many hit points you have in the early rounds and how well you manage your bank account. So with proper uh, money management, we can start to create a nice group of heroes who can battle it out to become number one. I think I think we're doing okay. Um, I really like this funny item, the target buddy. It, it gets the aggro from opponents and that really can throw a wrench into your plans. 
so like right now my team is getting smacked hard I'm hoping we can can heal though and catch up yeah warlock was able to hang on there that was pretty close oh could have been a draw draws rarely occur but they, they can happen especially with some neutral units that are spawned uh, but yeah I think we're doing okay so far in this round. Yep, so far so good. We were able to upgrade our heroes to get more HP. Yeah, I'm liking this next round. We just need to hang on a couple more rounds to get a new item. We badly need a new item. As you can see, our Slark is you know, killing them back there with the lifesteal. He is a beast. He can really, really kill that whole back line of soft units if left unchecked. If there's no disabler or tank in the back line, he can really wreak havoc. Okay, so the last normal player versus player round before we get to neutral. So round 20 is another neutral round. So far so good. I think our team is going to go far. Um, yeah, one guy's been eliminated already and we just formed a new three win streak so i'm really excited let's see how we do against these guys looks like uh slark is gone they have a nice strong back line with chaos knight and abaddon so he's got the knights and trolls alliance knights are pretty strong. I mean, they are my second option. I just have a hard time with their ace hero. I'm not sure if they even have one. Yeah, I don't think they have an ace hero. So that's why I go for the troll. It's still early, early uh, rounds, so we still have a chance to catch up. Ooh, we're finally getting some scaled heroes here. I think we should add Tidehunter. <coughs> oh, I should have added Tidehunter after round 20 so that my bankroll would get the extra 5 gold coins interest but it's okay you know um still new to this game and still learning the ropes it's pretty fun though i'm really excited for the new features to come out like the actual underlords i think these are gonna be like the boss heroes who have control of the map those kind of heroes. Lifesteal, yeah, lifesteal is always good. Um, I want to put that on a tanky hero. So we can get more tanky. That's even thing. So we're just waiting for a Troll to appear and Medusa. Oh my gosh, when. When Troll pops up and we give him the Mask of Madness Island, he is just going to roll over the opponent. He can single-handedly control the board. So, yeah, so far, so good. I think we're doing okay with this round. 
A slark with mask of madness is pretty scary. Yep, I think Tide needs a little more HP before we can give him the mask of madness. So we're gonna hand that over to our little buddy here. Slardars. Yes, things are So yeah, I like to keep um, some units in the back. Like support units in the back so that they can control the opponents with their spells. But in this case, I think we needed more tankings to counter the opponent's healing. He had a nice mix of healers over there. So let's see how we do with the next round. I'm trying to grab an alliance of scaled trolls. Scaled trolls are pretty powerful. As soon as we can get some ace heroes like a troll a warlord. Is that her? Yeah, True World, right? And Medusa. So right now, we're incomplete in that aspect. We're just going with the flow here until we can get some heroes to really help us out. Yeah, I think Slark can rescue us from this mess. He's pretty crazy once he gets in that back line. Hmm. I think we can put our bloodless hero over there. Give this guy a boost. Yeah, let's add more techies to our team. Bad Riders. Oh wow, our opponent has a full Knights Alliance already. Good on him. Really good on him. It's gonna be hard to beat. He is his He is Hancho 2.3. It's gonna be one to watch out for. It's gonna Level 3 Bat Rider, I've never seen that. Ever. I think they upgraded his costume. That's pretty cool. Looks pretty awesome at level 3. But yeah, we need a boost right now. should start going for level 10, why don't you? There you go. So, 
Right now I'm the first with 10 heroes and hopefully that will help us get um, an advantage. I mean an extra hero can really help. But it's also a risk because now I don't have interest coming in. So my gold, um, my bankroll basically is not gonna go up as much but now we just need to draw a ace hero an ace hero like medusa or troll warlord with a mask of madness that is just he's just gonna clean up so that's random rolls for you oh wow look at this Go for tombstone. That's gonna be interesting, right? Come on now. There you go. Out of boy. Cause our alliance. Okay, good. We have a complete. Oh my gosh! Are you kidding me? Suddenly, my opponent has one, two, three, five. Oh gosh! Wow, he did a good job on the rolls. Man, he got a three-star slot. Wow, that is a pretty, pretty good point. Wow. Okay, so far, um, I think we're gonna go with double. Look at that. Let's get some left going, guys. Okay, now I think our odds of winning have increased, but I'm not too sure by how much. You know, Troll is obviously a really powerful hero, so I got two ace heroes now, and I'm liking my odds. I'm really liking my odds now. <laughs> So hopefully around round 30 I can get a nice item for my Medusa. Um, yeah, so far we are doing a really good job. So I have the scale trolls are complete. Hoping to lock out with... Man, what do I go for? Should I go for that? That's always an option. Maybe more humans. Okay, let's see. Trolls are pretty strong, so I'm liking my odds of a troll warlord with Mask of Madness. So having two of them is pretty powerful. Uh, so yeah, I am really liking my odds now. My odds have improved by quite a bunch. If I could get another troll, oh my gosh, that would really help out. Give me some good rolls, guys. Disruptor. Shall we? Shall. Ooh, slide up. Two. I think we'll do that. Yeah. 
Why so serious? Oh no, this is it. This is it. Oh my, Medusa died. But is it, that was just the perfect matchup versus Phantom Assassin. A Medusa was able to slow her down just enough so that my the rest of my team could knock them out. So yeah, things are looking really good, I must say. We may have a chance of winning this all. I mean, we were able to beat a team of four three-star heroes, right? Okay, Dinos, give me a good item. Give me a good item. Oh, and we have another one. The Warrior Alliance. Oh, that's a really good combination. We are going all the way here. So far, so good. Give me a good item. Wow, Eye of Scabby. Yes. This will go perfect with my Medusa. Okay. And, uh, yeah, I think our alliance is uh, doing pretty good. Got a nice slardar going up. Yeah. This is looking great, actually. Can't complain too much. This is it, guys. Battle for the. Well, for Eva, so. Not really Falcon. Yeah, I think I have the advantage with Troll, Warlords, and uh, Medusa. Wow. Wow. I am surprised. Well, 10 heroes versus 8 heroes was always going to be an uphill battle for my opponent. Um. So I'd say we're doing good. We're actually more than okay now. If we could just get um, another Shadow Shaman, I think we're, we can go all the way. Yeah. Should be... Yeah, do it. Oh. I think I think we can go all the way guys. We have a four win streak. I'm liking our odds. We have five complete alliances. And our opponent only has nine heroes. So we should be in good shape. I think we'll be okay. Yeah. So far, so good. I think we lucked out on a couple of rolls. We were able to draw Medusa and two Warlords. So that helped. We also got a nice Slark to take care of their back line. Got some stunners. My bat riders not really upgraded at all, but can't complain. So it's oh, finally we got bat rider. Oh yeah, another. Oh my gosh, 
wow. Just look at this. Just wow. I think wow guys. Look at that. Like I think we really left healthy. We're gonna win this round. I am sure of it. I am just so sure of it. Like wow. We really left out. That was a good draw. We got we got patient and you know barring a, a really incredible opponent which he's he's got a good team, I must say. I have to be very careful with my team selection. Maybe adding Dragon then. Come on. Yes. What? That wasn't too good. But I think we'll do okay. It's just. Yeah. Nice win. Oh yeah. I think we're okay. Troll is really hard to beat when he gets going. And our opponent only has 8 heroes. So yeah, that should, I think, do it. We were able to get a victory against our opponent. Um, he might need to start buying Hero number nine. Otherwise, he's gonna be in trouble. Oh, and, yeah. And I got my oh, next Medusa. He's done for. I can honestly say he's done. He's cooked. We can cook him now. You know what I mean? So yeah, I think my my strategy of being patient worked out, but we don't know what our opponent has. Mm. I think we still have the advantage. Oh my gosh, Radiance, are you serious right now? Radiance. Okay. Well, I know where to put that in. Oh my god. Can you do it? Can. Should we? Nah. Should we? Should we? No. We're okay. Yeah, we're okay. I'm on fire! So we've got a 7 win streak. I think, you know, having the Radiance is really gonna help us in this battle. Uh, protecting the back line. Yep. So that's how you do it, guys. Woo! I think this was a very lucky round. I mean, obviously it's all random, right? But being patient and getting the proper team, the proper uh, positioning, it's really going to be helpful. So yeah, guys, check out my channel. I'll be posting this and a few more rounds in the future, so hit the subscribe button. See ya.